actually my name is vishnu surendran and i was like i graduated uh, in in 2020 so uh, it's like a covid period pandemic period so we don't have any like much opportunity at that time then i got a link from instagram that dg cool that was a dg cool so i just thought let's uh, let's try it so i just messaged him and i got a reply from them and we had a talk with them and ha huh, it's gone good then i started dg cool at that time i had a ha huh, i have a friend like she was my junior so i told her about this dg cool and we both joined together actually i was work, i was a student in background i came from a background of computer science only so at that time i had an interest in php and as well as the python and uh, i was like i have to learn about the i had a little bit interest in like react native or react js and all so i saw the full stack developing option from the digicool just saw a post in instagram and it was like in django and react full stack developing and at that time that django and react it's also now that django is a uh, django and react is like little bit hype in the industry computer industry so and also i wanted to learn the django because i had a little bit good interest in python and even i have done a little bit pro- uh, small projects in python and all in my college days so i just and even the react js uh, as i told you before like i ha Uh, I was like in fifth, sixth sem. I wanted to learn React JS and want to work on that project in React JS. But at that time, the time period was not so like exam studies and all. So I didn't appear for new like to a new uh, language for at that time for creating a project. At the pandemic time, I got uh, I got see the digital one. From the Instagram, only. I was just scrolling, 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 scrolling. At that time, I see the digital full stack developing React and Django, and both was like uh, my. I wanted to learn both languages, so I just tried, and later I got the reply and joined the digital. IS is basically it's an agreement like. uh policies and all so if a person ha huh, it has little bit uh if a person gets a job above 5 lakh lpa then only that person have to like pay the uh fees of the digicool like it's one one year or two years it's upon it was on earth it's like a, we can pay the fees in emi if i get a job of file like file pa that was i yes hmm the uh, actually the react was taught for by the tarun sir and the django was taught for the shubham sir and both were excellent like i start the like react was little bit new for me so i start it was like i know the uh, react uh, normal javascript and html css and all but at the start that react was not uh, like cup of tea cup of tea and then later on when i started working on the uh, projects and all then it was like how oh, it was too easy <laughs> why didn't i get before and even shubham sir was uh, too helpful uh, for us he always taught a better code like better coding style which was too easy to remember so it was much better because at that time the preparation was very good uh, the so uh, preparation in uh, lectures for their sessions interview preparation section uh, because of that my interview skills little bit enhanced and i have tried 3 to 4 interviews at last i got in this right because i had uh, given lots of interviews on the digital 
cut to the end of the solid and at last i got the white snow and at that time i was like pretty good con- confident about that job i can complete the interview now so it was not like because that start the interviews were like i la kya hoga tension <laughs> later on it was like okay okay fine interview just like a talking uh assignments are very good like because of the assignments uh my skills like practice workshops like my coding skills workshops and yeah even the coordinators were better like very good they always if i don't submit it on time they always ask us they don't shout us they just ask us when you will be completing and all so it was good nitin sir <laughs> he was like a good friend like he was talking like a friend better friend always tells us to always listen to our problems we do to why i didn't complete that no so it was good uh that will i told like every mem uh even some mem was very good he always she was always like whenever i just like fail in any interviews she was like it's okay we'll try next one so she she was like she always helping like in back pitting like you can do it mm, just practice <laughs> that's the better one we have to practice whatever we uh, they taught us and even we have to be like uh have to learn how to speak in interviews like how to tell a uh, convey our uh, pro- question answers and mostly we have to give an example of every question they ask if they are asked something about db like back end and it's like a relational or many to many and all so if we'll give them a better example using the many to many example uh, like live example the like car and color and all so it will impact a very good because i have used this like my coding skill was much better than my theory skill so okay. i can tell the answers like any theory questions but if they ask me some coding so i can code it for them in very fast it's not a big deal for me because i always practice on codes but i don't know the verbal things to be frank i didn't spend uh, but the assignments were very good because i will do the assignment that time my all the the all the skills all the theories which the sir taught us all covers in that assignment so if we we'll complete the assignment always complete that assignment it will be helpful for us always do the assignments even though it's late but i do it because of that the practice happens it's better to practice every day 